wassail. It's uh, solstice morning and I've come to the long man of Wilmington uh, because today I need to talk about these two poles. This is a gatekeeper. This underneath here is a hollow gateway and he wants to talk uh, about the notion of these two polarities that are changing. I know we're polarities every day, but this one's quite exciting. So Ceres is in a kind of way, it's in that cluster in Capricorn and it's to do with the sacral. Now, during this eclipse season, the solar eclipse is gonna come in and then we're waiting two weeks as we head towards the lunar eclipse to complete the action. And this is where these two gateways come in. So one is, self-love the other is self-loathing so we're being caught between the two now i've been up this morning and i've gifted the long man with my friend the celtic oracle with some mead and i've also left two uh, sacred stones that i've been programming the the need that you have at the moment is you have to Try and give, as I said yesterday, this phoenix that's rising in you, this new mass, divine masculine solar plexus energy and earthing energy has got to cleanse the sacral. So you need to get crystals, um, program them with self-love and your love of the earth and the planet and put them in the ground. Now, it's interesting because for me, it is Saturn that is the natural world. Now, I know a lot of astrologers won't go with that, but it's all about new information and new ways of looking at things. So, Saturn is just by Ceres, and Ceres will move as we go through and become more aware of the uh, energies of Venus and the others as we move towards the lunar eclipse. So, try and find a place of self-love, because self-love within the new divine masculine because you've got to get your molecules you've got to appreciate parts of your body things you're not comfortable with about yourself you've got to learn to love them so find a way get some crystals put them in the ground and give your sacral self-love to the planet okay to the earth this is what the long man here is saying to do and this is solstice we're just three days away now from that eclipse really pushing in don't forget christmas day kind of 24 hours before it'll take place notice the silence of wildlife wildlife all over the world suddenly goes there's something happening so listen out for that other than that think about this portal this is not just self-love and self-loathing it's 5d frequency 3d frequency which are you going to choose to ride once we enter 2020? Are you going to keep doing the self-loathing that comes up, that disgust in yourself and that disgust in others? Or are you going to move towards the self-love that will activate your heart chakra and push out the most beautiful message to people? So that's this little short video. Happy, happy winter solstice. The veil is thin. Talk to your ancestors. Ask them why your self-loathing issues come up and try and find a way to self-love. Okay? Wassail people!